Teaching mathematics is not an easy task for teachers, especially when dealing with children who are weak in their basic mathematical skills. This is SJKC Sangming Sibu Sarawa. This school has an enrollment of 244 children. They come from various ethnic background, namely Chinese, Iban, Malay, Malanao, and Dusun. This school is also situated in a rural area where the overall academic performance is considerably low, especially where the subject of mathematics is concerned. According to Madam Tang Mi Lei, basic mathematical skills have to be acquired first before children can progress further in learning mathematics. With these skills, their interest for mathematics should naturally increase. They would also be more confident in trying to solve the mathematical problems given by their teachers. I was posted to this school in the year 2001. When I started teaching, I discovered that the children here are very weak in their basic mathematical skills. In my opinion, children, especially in year 1, 2, and 3, should first be given enough training in their basic mathematical skills. This will prepare them for the learning of the advanced mathematical skills when they get into year 4, five and six. With the help from the teachers in this school and various parties, I have created a teaching aid which I have named EMAX. EMAX is a versatile teaching aid which can be used for teaching a wide range of topics in mathematics. The EMAX innovation is also aimed at creating interest in the teaching and learning of mathematics in this school. E is an acronym for the word easy, whereas maths, as it is already known, is the short form of the word mathematics. Generally, e maths gives an idea that mathematics is easy to learn when the basic mathematical skills are clearly understood. Cheap conventional materials are utilized to construct EMATs. They consist of This is a piece of board which consists of various sections which displays the place value of digits in tens and ones. On the same board, there is also the question slot and the answer slot. This board may also be adjusted to be used according to the various skills to be taught by the teacher. Straws to be used as counters. Number clock. Operation clock. Mathematical tables for addition. Subtraction, multiplication, and division, and answer cards. Now, 
Let us take a look at how the EMATS board is being used in the teaching and learning the basic skills of the addition process. In Sit down. I brought something for you today. Can you guess what is inside the bag? No. Okay, I'll show it to you. What is this? Candle. Candle. How many candles are there? Oh. Here is one more candle. How many candles are there? Three. Three. Two plus one equals three. three. So this is our topic today. It's about addition. With the topic, please. Addition. Good. Okay. We will use Emacs board to solve the addition problems. Let's look at question number one. With the number sentence? Five plus seven. Five plus seven. Find out number five. Okay. We paste it on the one's place. Okay. The second is addition symbol. We find the symbol for addition. Pass it on the symbol column. The second number is seven. This is number seven. Pass it on the one's place. Now we have five plus seven. First, we have to take five strokes from the box. Let's count the strokes together with me. To put these rows into one's place. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Another one is seven. We have to take another seven rows. into one place. One, two, three, four, five. Two more left. We put it into the car. Group this all time once. Become one ten. Put one times into ten place. Two strokes left. Put into one place. How many strokes in one place? Two. Two. How many times in ten place? One. One. What is our answer here? Twelve. Twelve. Now, let's check our answer with addition table. This is the checking board. We'll put it like this. First row, we have five. First column, we have seven. And the answer is? Twelve. Is it the same? Yes. Very good. Now. Emacs. 
may also be used to teach subtraction. Let us take a look at how Emacs is being used to solve the following question. Nine minus four. Step one is to change the mathematical sentence into the standard written method. Place the number nine block at the top of the ones column. Then, place the operation block here. Next, put the number four block at the bottom of ones column. Step two. Put in nine straws into the ones column. Step three: Take away four straws from the ones column. Step 4. Count the number of straws left. Step 5. Place the number 5 block in the answer column. The next step is to check the answer using the subtraction table board. Emacs can also be used to teach multiplication. Let us take a look at how Emacs is being used to solve the following question. 5 times 4 Step 1 is to change the mathematical sentence into the standard written method shown. Step 2. Place 5 cups under the Emacs board. Step 3. Place one straw in each of the cups repeatedly until all the cups contain four straws each. Step 4. Place the straws one by one into the ones column. Once it is full, move all the ten straws into the tens column. Repeat the steps until all the straws in the cup is being used. Move all the ten straws into the tens column. Count all the straws in the ones and the tens columns. Put the correct number block at the answer column. The next step is to check the answer using the multiplication table board.
in order to use EMATS to teach division, the EMATS board has to be adjusted this way. Let us take a look at how EMATS is being used to solve the following question. 24 divide by 8. Change the mathematical sentence into the standard written method. Prepare 8 paper cups. Take 24 straws and put them one by one in each cup until all is being used. Count the straws in the first cup. Place them in the ones column. Count all the straws in the ones and the tens columns. Put the relevant number block in the answer column. Check the answer using the division table board. It has also been proven that the EMS board is very effective in the teaching of more than 50 types of skills in the mathematics syllabus. Besides that, the use of the EMS board can increase the pupil's level of achievement, encourage a better teacher-pupil relationship, build up the confidence of the teacher and pupils, make the classroom lessons more interesting and reduce the number of pupils requiring the remedial lessons. Use of this innovative design invented by Martin Tan Mille, I discovered that the children's interest in the subject of mathematics in this school has considerably increased. And the number of people sent for remedial classes have reduced. I'm very confident that this teaching aid is able to help children improve their mathematical skills. I'm also very confident that this innovative design is especially helpful to primary one to primary three pupils. That's I should say for all the tasks Satu pupils, especially for those slow learners, because the mathematical sentence to the slow learner group is very abstract. But with the help of this teaching aid, the pupils they can learn through real touching and feeling of the mathematical sentence. With this, they have better and deeper impression and concept of the mathematical sentence. And I'm also confident that this teaching aid is usable and applicable to all the schools throughout Malaysia because with the full utilization of the school teachers and with the whole participation of the students, then I should say that the students who understand better and benefit more from the learning of mathematics in their schools. I have started using the Emacs board since May 2003. I found out that the level of basic mathematical skills acquired has increased. The use of EMATS in the teaching and learning process has been proven effective when it was awarded the top prize for innovation in teaching by the Ministry of Education in 2004. Since then, 
Madam Tang Mi Lei has been promoting and demonstrating the use of emats to teachers in Sarawak.